I'm Amanda De Silva, and in this Monday Mindset video, I'm going to share with you how I got fired from the C-suite and what I did to recover. Now, the reason for my choosing this topic this week is that I know many of us have struggles and really difficult things that we face. I thought that it would be great to put one of my significant struggles out there so that we can all learn how we can bounce back and be a great influence for ourselves and for other people. So that's the reason for my sharing this with you. The first part that I would like to discuss, and it's, it's basically three parts that helped me recover, and that was what I called the reset. So it was a button that I attributed and kind of pushed with my inner being and thought, you know what, um, life isn't over. This is something I thought I was going to be doing for the long term. It didn't end with my expectation in mind. It was shortened, which is actually okay because it has worked to my benefit. And I'm allowed to do the things that I really aspire to do, and that is to be in front of you and to spread my knowledge, my enjoyment, my enjoyment for learning and teaching with you. So the first topic for my reset was that I shortened a pity party. I had a small, short pity party where I thought, you know what, if people are um, discussing a contract and they're in question of uh, my value to an organization, I don't want to be there. And so I had a small cry. I talked to a few really close people and shared some of my intimate thoughts who reassured me that, you know what, everything happens for a reason and it's okay. So make sure that you have that time to connect with yourself. Get over what that is and realize it's not actually about you. Number two then is your internal reset. So realizing again that your job is not you and who you are and allow yourself to dream again. Think about what is it actually I want as I was running around um, living other people's dreams, working all the situations out so that they could have what they wanted fulfilled, but then I forgot I need to be fulfilled myself and my family needs that fulfillment and I put that time back into me. So number two, put that time back into you and reset. Then you need to take action. So this is where you shift and you make sure that you put things that you want to happen into a workable plan and you do. So you move towards that goal and every day, step by step, you look at your goals, you figure out an achievable plan and you work towards that consistently and daily. Now, in my human kinetics degree, we looked at Newton's laws and the third law of Newton's laws is action reaction. So for every action, there is an equal and opposite reaction. If you look at the actions that you want to take, the way you want to feel, and you act on that, you put that out into the world, you want that equal and opposite reaction to come back to you, correct? So this is where you make sure you put that into place. So these three simplistic steps, although there are many internal struggles and many steps within these steps, there are three, right? So the first one is the problem and dealing with that. The second one is the reset. The third one is action, action, reaction that you wish to see. I hope these things provide a great, greater clarity and a way for you to tackle some of the internal problems that you struggle with or any struggles that come upon you. With that, I would like to say thank you for listening to me again on this weekly Mindset Monday. And if you wish, please go to my website at www.amanda-desilva dot com forward slash newsletter to sign up for my weekly newsletter so they land in your inbox weekly and as well click on the bottom of the screen where you see the subscribe button for my youtube channel that way each week when i have a new mindset monday uploaded it's there for you to watch